हेलो डू यू नो टूल्स ऑफ मेजरमेंट इन एपिडेमियोलॉजी इफ यू डोंट नो सो ट्राई टू अंडरस्टैंड द एपिडेमियोलॉजिस्ट यूजली एक्सप्रेस डिजीज मैग्नीच्यूड एज अ रेट इन टर्म्स ऑफ रेशियो और इन टर्म्स ऑफ प्रपोर्शन a clear understanding of the term is required for proper interpretation of epidemiological data if we have epidemiological data so we need to proper interpretations so the basic tools of measurement in epidemiology we generally use rate ratio and proportions these three measurements are important to to write the disease and frequencies now we will discuss about rate first what is the rate so rate when we say there were 500 deaths from motor vehicle accident in a city a during 1985 it is just nothing more than counting deaths in the city during that particular area we can say 500 deaths it means that's only counting such a statement might be sufficient for the municipal administrator to provide necessary health services but it conveys no meaning to an epidemiologist who is interested in comparing the frequency of accident in city a with that in city b to allow such comparison the frequency must be expressed as rate so the if this situation we can calculate rate like a rate measures the occurrence of some particular event development of disease or the occurrence of death in a population during a given time period so here time period is important points rate is a statement of the risk of developing a condition it indicates the change in some event that takes place in a population over a period of time so an example of typical rate is the death rate it can be calculate like number of death in a year divided by mean year population multiply by 1000 so in a year we have to take in denominator a mean year population so an example of a typical rate is a death rate which is death rate as we know number of death in one year divided by mean year population multiply by 1000 so a rate comprises the following elements we required numerator we required denominator and we require time specification and multiplier like this 1000 so the time dimension is usually a calendar year we use and the rate is expressed per 1000 or some other round figure 10000 and 100000 selected according to convenience or convention to avoid fraction so this is the simple way for calculation of the rate so we can say crude rates so what is the crude rates these are the actual observed rates such as the birth and death rates crude rates are also known as unstandardized rate so we can say specific rates these are the actual observed rates due to specific causes like tuberculosis are occurring in specific groups for example age six groups are during specific time periods like annual monthly or weekly rates and standardized rates we can calculate these are obtained by direct or indirect methods of standardization and adjustment for example age and sex standardization rate so here tools of measurements we need to understand we have to uh aware about rate ratio proportion so here we have discussed the rate rate numerator required denominator required and time specific required we can calculate simply rate thank you